I am Rebecca Greenberg Ellis, and I handle the development here at CONCAN. And my favorite teacher, I actually was fortunate enough to have Mario Padilla twice. Um, he started working with our class in seventh grade. Our English teacher was pregnant and went on maternity leave a couple months into the school year. So Mario came into a classroom, um, you know, another teacher's students, another teacher's lesson plan. There's probably nothing more challenging than doing that, especially in middle school. And he was just amazing. Um, he came in and sort of picked up right where she had left off, but brought his own energy and enthusiasm and creativity and really just um, pushed us to be um, really excellent students, always expected a lot from us, asked us to expect a lot of ourselves, and it was just, it was fantastic. Um, and obviously he did well because the school brought him back in 10th grade for English, um, and he I think had a background in university teaching, so he sort of just um, didn't compromise what he expected out of high schoolers. And um, I remember at one point we were writing paper, and it was a big term paper, a big part of our overall grade depended on our grade on this essay um, about the poets of the Romance era. And I put my heart and soul into this thing um, and turned it in and got a B plus, which uh, was heartbreaking for me. And uh, he talked to me after class and really sort of gave me probably what I had, I had never received constructive feedback like that before and really forced me to think critically about my work um, in a way that I don't think most high school teachers expect their students to do. So I went back and made the paper better and ended up getting an A. Um, and I think I learned a really valuable lesson about always striving to be excellent, always pushing yourself to go further than you think you can. And, um, you know, Mario was... Uh, Frequently his socks didn't match, and I think his briefcase was about 40 years old, um, and he was probably the quintessential English teacher in a lot of ways, but I think it's in, thanks in large part to him that I went to college. So thank you very much, Mario Padilla.